All right, we got a personal box here. I'm excited about this one. Um, I've been doing cards a long time, long, long time. Very fortunate to do it for a living, too. Um, but I've never opened a Transcendent collection. I will now. It's going to be Transcendent Tennis for Leeway on the Blowout Forums. So what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and get it out of the uh, outer box, put it up here on the table. We'll start to unpack the stuff from the inner box. We'll place it down, and then um, you can let me know in order what you want to go through first. So... Um, while I'm getting it out of the outer box, there's four things in there. There's one is the base set. So if you don't want me to open that, if you want me to keep that sealed, I can do that for you. So that's the first thing uh, I need you to let me know. And then the second thing is in what order would you like me to go through the items? Um, we have the cut autograph, the super fractor, and then the uh, autograph box. So those are the three things. So yes or no on the base set. Uh, if you want me to open it and go through the cards, I can show you those. Um, and then let me know the order on the other three. I'm going to cut this out now, though. Let me see. Okay. Just out of the way. All right. And I'm going to ship it back to you in the, uh, the case here. Um, with the exception of the autographs, I will top load all that. Um, base set sealed, autos cut super. All right. That's what it looks like. It's got the uh, invitation right on top there. So that looks like it's affixed to the outer shrink wrap, so I'm going to have to peel this off. But as I let you know, that is good. I'll keep it sealed. That is good for one year after the date. So. Okay, well, I mean, it's still a good idea, honestly, especially if you're keeping it for the PC. I, my PC, I grade pretty much all the stuff. I'm actually more lenient on that, to be honest. Um, I'll send stuff in that I know is going to 8, 5, or 9 just because I'm keeping it. So if you, uh, if you do want me to check, just let me know. Even if it's, you know, we hit like a Federer or a Na or Osaka or Sampras or whoever it is that you're uh, kind of hoping for. Um, let me actually do my best here to not get the box. I'll be happy to check. Transcendent generally grades fairly well. Um, it's pretty easy for the most part, as long as the frame isn't scratched, which happens sometimes, but... Sorry, I'm being a little particular here. I want to keep the box... For how expensive the product is, I want to keep the box in uh, as good a shape as possible without any cut marks. That way, if you choose to store it in there, you'll be good. Okay. Shrink wrap out of the way. I believe it uh, slides open sideways. Nope, oh, comes open from the top here. Okay, so I sh okay. All right, so I'm almost positive when I take this top layer off. I'm still gonna have layers on top, so I won't be able to see anything. All right. Okay, so here's our first thing. I believe this is our base set, which I will keep sealed for you. It is, if it matters. It is number 15 of 50. They actually have it down here on the box. So there's the base set, 15 of 50. Yeah, okay. That's what I thought. Here's our stack of autographs. And then let me just get these out of the box. The super right here. And then the cut autograph down below, or possible dual cut autograph. Okay, I'm gonna place that on the invitation, use it as a backdrop. All right, so now I'm gonna get this out of the way. We'll go through the, uh, the auto set first, I believe was our request. 
Good luck, brother. Same thing. I'm gonna be. I'm gonna take a second and cut through this very carefully. That way, um, you can keep the box intact. I am gonna soft sleeve all these guys as I go. Um, or do you want me actually? Let me know. Do you want me to put them back in the box here, or do you want me to soft sleeve top load for you? Um, I'm gonna soft sleeve them for right now. But if you um, if you don't want that, if you want me to just put them back in the box, let me know. I could always change it uh, change it later. So uh, 50 card autograph set. You get 30 of them here. They're all gonna be numbered to 25, and we're looking at two parallels, which will be either number to five or one of ones. So, hoping, hoping for the Federer. Big Federer is what we're looking for. So I cut it there in the groove so it shouldn't make a mark on the case. Okay, cool. I'll soft sleeve them and then um, I'll have to top load them too because if I soft sleeve them, they won't fit back in here. So I'll, I'll soft sleeve and top load them, but I'll ship the, the empty box along with the contents of the rest of the, uh, the main box to you. All right, let's figure out which way this is facing. It's facing this way. Okay. So each card has a... Um, little paper uh, between them to separate them. So what I'll do is I'm going to take them all out and just kind of stack them here, and then we'll go through them one by one. And I'll soft sleeve them as we go. And I don't know where the parallels are located in the box. I don't know if they're in the beginning, the end. I know with baseball from the, the breaks I remember seeing, they were just kind of wherever they were. Um, they were like randomly located. So, all right, here we go. We'll start off with that first little small stack that I took out at the beginning. All right, good luck, brother. Starting off with Tracy Austin, 5 of 25. Nick Bolatieri, 18 of 25. So the autographs all have different serial numbers on them, um, unlike the base set. Like some of them have two uh, pieces of paper between them. Don't know why that is, but... Rosie Casals, Castles, not sure. A little bit uh, before my time. 20 of 25 on Rosie. And the final one in this stack, Kim Kleisters, 3 of 25. There's someone I know. Kim Kleisters. All right, we'll move on to this stack over here. Well, there's one of our parallels, Yvonne. Can't see her last name. Golagong, it looks like. An emerald to five. Her last name is kind of covered by her autograph. But that is it. Golagong. Emerald, one of five. Just want to see a Roger. Just want to see a Feds. That's it. One Federer. There's a nice one. Steffi Graf, 22 of 25. On the graph. Ooh, Justine Hennen. 12 of 25. So who's the uh, the biggest name in the cut auto six? I was looking at it and honestly don't recognize like 98% of the people in there. I think we got our other emerald here. Oh, that's a good one. 
Second parallel. It's another emerald, but it's Martina Hingis. There you go. It's got to be... She's probably, what, top five in the set? So, awesome hit up there on the Hingis. Awesome. She's right up there. It's probably her, Federer, uh, Osaka, Lina, Sampras, and Agassi are probably your top six. So, boom! Awesome. I picked a good one. I picked a good one! Uh, yeah, Ash was the, uh, the one I obviously saw that I recognized, but... Uh, Yevgeny Kofilnikov, 20 of 25. Thankfully, I watch a lot of hockey, so a name like that, piece of cake. Top three, I, was, I would have said confidently top five for Hingis. Um, I didn't know if she was better or worse than uh, Sampras, Agassi, Na, Osaka. I, I don't know where they go, but in order. I just know that's, that's the creme de la creme, so happy for you, man. That's a good one. We just got to get a Federer now. Jan Codes, 14 of 25. And I think we got another emerald. Gustavo Curtin, another name I know. So I thought it was supposed to be two parallels per box, but that is three. I might have uh, might have misread that. Gustavo Curtin to five. This other stack in the back here. Help the camera out. Stop confusing it where the focus is. Rod Laver. Oh, no problem, dude. I'm happy. Happy we got a big one. I'm nervous here. I just want to hit you a Federer, but I mean, now if I don't hit the Federer, I feel a lot better. <laughs> I feel a lot better that we got a you know a thousand dollar Hingis at least. Uh, Amelie. Moresmo, 9 of 25. So here's what I was kind of uh, talking about. So you can see here this frame. I don't know. If, let's see if I can get the camera to focus. On the bottom left side here is like um, it's scratched. This is like your biggest problem with Transcendent is the, the frame sometimes they scratch, especially because they're like in there on top of each other without like any real protection. So actually, I think that was just fuzz. Yeah, never mind. It was just fuzz. It's fuzz from the lining on the inside of the box. Looked like scratch. I didn't want to play with it, but definitely fuzz. There's another nice one. Martina Navratilova. With the illest rec specs of all time. So, a nice one there. 25, of 20, uh, 25 on Navratilova. Manuel Orantes, one of 25. Charlie Paris, Paris, Paris Rail, Pissarro. Not sure where the emphasis of the syllables is on that one. Passarel? Oh, that's because I read it dyslexically. Passarel, not Paracel. Passarel. 16 of 25. Come on, Roger. Roger. Dennis Ralston, 4 of 25. I wonder if they, um... I wonder if they, uh, what's it called? Cause I'm, I'm sure, I'm assuming that these are hand, um, hand-packed. I wonder if they, when they put, like, a big, like, Hingis or something like that in, like, they intentionally leave out the Federer. I hope not. Tony Roth, Roche, can't see, signed over, Roche, looks like a C is signed over his, uh, his name. But I'd still rather have a, a nice Roger, even though that Hingis is sweet. I want to I wanna see a big Roger. Tim Corrier, 15 of 25. Francois Durr, 24 of 25. All right. 
Well, we got a one one Roy Emerson. Roy Emerson. So there's our one of one. Not super duper familiar with him. I, I might have read the sell sheet wrong. I, I could have swore it said that it was a 50 um, a fifty autograph set and there's 30 autographs in the box. But I'm, I might have read that wrong. Chris Everett, nice one. 11 of 25. And I don't know if you're... Well, I mean, if it's a 50-card set, they made 50 boxes. I guess you would be guaranteed a one of one per box. So I think I did... I think I might have just read the, the sell sheet wrong. Ooh. Okay. Got a platinum 101, I think, coming here. So I definitely read the sell sheet wrong. Yeah, here's the platinum. You want me, I'll save, you want me to save the platinum for the end? I'll save the platinum for the end. Yeah, I, I must have read the sell sheet wrong. Gigi Fernandez, 19 of 25. Okay. So I half read it correctly. <laughs> We'll save that platinum. When it's Federer, we'll celebrate. Murat Safin, 21 of 25. Could have went a little easy on the pen there, but still very nice. And it's not like it's that far away, but we'll save it. We got a couple more to go here. Pam Schriever, 6 of 25. Margaret Smith Court, 22 of 25. Honestly, if I didn't know any better, I would have thought she signed her name Raymond. Kind of looks like Raymond. But I can also see Margaret knowing that that's what the name is now. Fred Stoley, or Stoll, 10 of 25. Could be Stoley. I... Just don't know. Right, next to last one. Virginia Wade, 13 of 25. And our final one before we do the platinum. Natasha. Hmm. Zareva? I'll go with Zareva. Natasha Zareva. All right, let's see what this platinum has in store. Just be a big one. Big dog platinums. Oh my God. Ha! <laughs> let's go. Unbelievable. I mean, I always try. <laughs> hey, here comes the Dominguez Super Frat. It never works. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. 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 You sure you don't want to send anything in for grading? Like the best card in the product? Wow. <laughs> I don't think it's ever going to get better than that for us, dude. Holy Jesus. I started to see the background because I knew that that's what the background photo was, was the words. And I was just like, nah, it can't be. It can't be. 
Oh my goodness. Well, you got two curse words out of me in the same break, so you know you know something crazy got hit. Whew. All right, I mean, let's do the other stuff here. Not like it matters. I mean, it's it matters, but who cares? Wow. So cut auto. Um, I don't know which way is up. Looks like this way. Okay, so I'm gonna slide it from the side. Nope, that's upside down. Upside down. Let's flip it. All right, let's try that again. You're dumbfounded. I'm holding it. Oh my gosh. <laughs> well, you own it though, so I guess I guess it we're equal. All right, here we go. One of one cut. Bobby Riggs reminds me of the bad guy in one of uh, the Family Guy episodes, Bobby Briggs. But all the best from Bobby Riggs. So I got nothing there. But wow. Wow, wow, wow. Federer, one of one. Wow. All right. And the Super Fractor, this one should be a little bit easier. I'll go from the top and see if you can identify the player. Slow roll it. Pat Rafter. That's that's a never heard of, but and I, honestly, from the picture, I don't know if Pat Rafter is a guy or a girl. With that androgynous name and the flowing locks. Could be a guy or a girl, but... Don't know. But Pat Rafter Super. Bobby Riggs Cut. But holy... Banana Rama. The Goat. Roger. One of one Platinum... Absolute monster, product hit, best thing I've ever pulled in my whole life. Wow. Okay, dude, all right. I, <laughs> I would have guessed dude if I had to, but I mean, could be a chick. Got like a, the blonde ponytail happening. But just let's look at this for another second here. Holy goodness. Wow. Wow. Well, um, you let me know. No problem, dude. You let me know about grading it, um, especially for this guy. Um, so, yeah, it might be something you just want to do just to keep it super duper safe, um, regardless of what the grade will be. I mean, like I said, it's a product hit. It's as good as it gets. So um, just let me know in a message. So I, I don't know if you're... Well, I know I can guarantee you that you will not do better than this. But if you have, if you have something that you would like to bring to the party, um, yeah. <laughs> so, congrats again, dude. So, one more time. Federer, one of one. Totally forgot about the Hingus Emerald to five that we pulled. Pat Rafter, super, 1952 style. And our cut, with a nice little inscription... All the best from Bobby Riggs. So that's going to do it, guys. Um, I'm happy that that was just a one, one and done for tonight because there's no way we're living up to that no matter what it is that we're opening next. So, Leeway, wow. Congrats, dude. Happy for you. Um, I'm going to go ahead and end the recording, and I'm going to go have a beer and celebrate. That was the best thing I've ever pulled. So, good for us.